Initiation retro. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, is to bypass Bloom security doors and get inside. Then find and erase your personal CTOS profile. Whatever they have on me, it's all bullshit. And I'm sick of getting harassed for it. All the more reason for a purge. We'll be watching. Try to keep up. By the way, we put this playlist together to set the mood. Hope you like it. You're wasting your time. He's not in. Gotcha. So that's him. He's got a gun. Is that a problem? Well, problems are why you keep me around, right? Time him. I'm curious. Too late. He's in. Already? Don't say I don't know. I have no idea. Nuh-uh. No synonyms either. Give me a real answer. I'm just not that into aliens or video games. It's not just any alien. It's... Oh, come on. Anyone else having a problem with their phone? Oh, God. Oh, God. Ah! Ah! Ah!
So what's his deal? He was raised in Oakland, but was born in... <laughs> his deal is, he's been hanging around the dead sec IRC, and he's got cred. Figured we'd give him a test drive. On the hardest difficulty, nobody's been able to delete their CTOS profile before. I want to see if he's smart, stubborn, or both. CTOS tagged him as the prime suspect in a high-tech burglary, so... He's done time? Community service. Not enough evidence. Just the word of CTOS's predictive algorithms. But once in the system... Always in the system. Holy shit! He went for it! We won't have much time before the backups kick in. Going in the hot aisle. It's at least 120 degrees in there. Give the man props. It's going the mile. Nobody's gotten that far. This is like the secret cow level. Why is my threat so high? This is bullshit.
or I could just drop a little back door into the system so I can get back inside later. Sorry, Bloom. We've got unfinished business. He's heading out. Bag him. Yeah. Fuck I'm gonna go. Josh! Okay, okay. Fuck you, Bloom! In 2013, Chicago realized the promise of smart cities with CTOS, a citywide operating system merging big data with surveillance, security, and transit programs. With a few hundred lines of code, hackers were able to hijack its central servers and cripple the entire grid. Many believed the attack would be a killing blow for smart city development. They were wrong. Coordinated from the heart of Silicon Valley, CTOS 2.0 has been implemented across the United States, ushering in the Internet of Things. 6.4 billion connected devices now serve as collection points, mapping and recording our daily routines, making a more secure and more invasive system. But who else is listening? Big Brother no longer works alone. Thousands of little brothers monitor and aggregate your every move, building a complete digital profile of you to be bought, sold, or stolen in an instant. Toys study your children, reporting their play habits back to marketers. Appliances, consoles, and home security systems give corporations a window into your private life. Control of your vehicle and mobile device can now be breached remotely by anyone at any time. You may think that you are immune or underestimate the risk, but your digital shadow is already compromised. Insurance companies use algorithms to monitor your life habits and limit or deny coverage. Health providers determine if your cancer is is worth treating. Search results and news fees are skewed to bias mood and influence your vote, engineering social uprisings on a massive scale. You are now less valuable than the data you produce. Data you produce. This is the new reality. Going dark is no longer an option. With threats to personal freedom rising, many are stepping forward. Whistleblowers, activists, and hackers have drawn their battle lines, putting the establishment on watch. But are they threats themselves, or have they become freedom's last line of defense? Freedom's last line of defense. So, am I in? Welcome to Dead Sec. <sighs> uh, 
I'm Satara. This sweetheart is Josh, a.k.a. Hot Sauce. Yo, you're Hot Sauce? Yo, man, I loved your frat house hat. Real talk. Thanks. This weirdo's wrench. The needs of the many. And this Casanova is Horatio. What's up, brother? What's up, man? It's the crew, huh? Took y'all long enough to come get me. Shit. You saw Bloom's bullshit. CTOS isn't just regulating infrastructure. The amount of personal data that thing is collecting is fucking mind-blowing. Yeah. It's big brother and little brother all rolled up into one. Huh? Sees everything you do and tells on you. Thank you, Josh. So what's the fix? Sledgehammers and fire. No! Sledgehammers on fire. <laughs> All of that data in one place means they can reject your fucking application before you click on it. Congratulations, you have been free rejected for our credit card. Or your house, or your insurance. That's not even the worst case scenario. All that data in the hands of the government? They'll arrest you for shit before you even do it. Yeah, I've been there. I don't fucking know why. Man, f fuck it! Fuck it, man. We're hackers. We, we out think, we out dare. I, I say we tear down the fucking wall. Hey, show everyone what, what Bloom's up to, man. Show, show the world that their personal data is being used to rob them of their fucking freedoms. Fuck. I installed a back door, so all we gotta do is walk right through. Uh, hold on. You what? He installed the back door, so all we have to do is walk through. Bingo. Hey, man. Do you have the time? Oh, yeah, man. I, I got it. I got it. Kind of late for a night run, isn't it? Hey, what, are you, what are you running from the cops? <laughs> Maybe I am one. Hey, hey you, you look familiar. <laughs> Have a good party. Fucking ping this motherfucker. <laughs> Fuck you, Bloom. I'm gonna go have a goddamn good time. phone is this? It's your new phone. Where's my phone? In the ocean, where you threw it, I think. I don't remember. I was pretty smashed. Look, meet us at the hackerspace. Where? Check your pics and figure it out.
guess I was lit, huh? <laughs> like Mardi Gras. Go get yourself something to wear, and I'll tell you where to go next. Oh, and you'll need your phone ready for operations. So hit the store and download your apps before you get here. Damn, walk of shame on my first day. No, no way. After I saw some homeless guy poop right on the beach, I so stopped going. You know people should. Hi! Hey, sorry,
All right, Sitar. So where you at? Sending you the location and the passcode for the door. Well, they're saying it never reached their account. Tengo los recibos. El de la transferencia de que llegó al destinatario. No pueden hacerle esto. They can and they are. Any inquiry is going to take months. Where's your abuela going to live while you're going through all that, huh? Finally. So Josh and I spoke, and fucking over Bloom has been a long-standing project. All right, you need two things to take down Bloom. You need to get people to rally behind your cause to separate you from the trolls. And we need bots, and a lot of them to handle the data CTOS is processing. Thank you, Josh. We spent all night modifying our app so you can get followers to download the app, and we can use their processing power for the cause. This is happening? It's really happening? Mm -hmm. Yeah, man, this is happening. You better get to it. <laughs> Hell yeah, man! Barbarians are at the gate and ready to bust some Roman heads. And yeah, we're gonna focus on some high profile ops, play them for exposure and laughs to get people to download our app. Mm -hmm. All right. Don't worry. So that was something fun. <laughs> Marcus! <laughs> Check you out. Alive and dry. I wasn't sure after your moonlight swim. Come here. You've got to check this out. Behold, our very own open source research app. So, like, all of us here pool vulnerabilities that we find, and we encourage everyone to share their work, their research, etc. Okay, so what's the research app do? Widen our skill set? Make us irresistible to the gender of our choice? What, so it's like a I know kung fu kind of deal? If kung fu was a gender and not so 1999, absolutely.
called? The Wonders of Technology? A 3D printer? This is the Army of Printers. It is capable of pumping out an arsenal of lethal weapons down. Seriously? Yep. Once you master it, voila! Hipster merchant of death. All good, except I'm no hipster. <laughs> you keep telling yourself that. Now try to make something. But don't blow us up. Good to have another brother here. Good to be here, man. Are you all hackers? Yeah, kind of a basic requirement to get invited into the hacker space. But we all have our specialties, like Josh over there. Always building shit that shouldn't work. Now he's trying to build this big-ass drone. And Wrench? Good engineer, too. But better at breaking shit apart. And yo, Satara? <laughs> Sis got skills as an artist and a graphic designer. Without her, dead sex walking around without a face or voice. What about you? What's your superpower? Tactical coordinator, or cat herder. Take your pick. I make dead set go where it has the most impact. You heard of Prime 8? Those are some real dirty hacking motherfuckers. Yeah, I brushed up against them before. It wasn't pleasant. All right, that's what I like to hear. Link up with me when you're ready to do this, and I'll fill you in. There's always someone running ops against Prime 8. Bet they'd love your help. It's something, right? This whole place is something. We used to keep track of news feeds on here, but now it's our follower wall. So it knows if we're trending? No, no, no. It's based on hard values. How many people downloaded our app, how much processing power we have access to, you know. <laughs> nice. And speaking of which, we're downloading the DeadSec app into your phone as we speak. When it's ready, open it up, click the suggested op, and hit the park outside so we can test it. Sounds good. One more thing. I put a reminder on your phone so you remember what we're gunning for. Get enough processing power to take down Bloom. Sorry.
The app's downloaded and I'm in the park. What am I testing? Start profiling things around you. People, devices. See what you can pull from them. That's what helps us figure out our next ops. And running ops that are important to people is how we get them interested in DeadSec. The more followers download our app, the more intel we get. It's the circle of life. Oh, and see if you can find some components to help us with our research. Hipster merchant! <sighs> the app is your data mining tool. Of death! Okay, okay, I got this. So what now? Up to you, man. You're free to do whatever catches your eye. We post ops to the DeadSec app, and doing them helps us get followers. And followers are our Skrilla. Followers mean computers, which boosts our processing power, which lets us do bigger and better ops. Hey, so what's this about Bobo Dakes? You know Bobo's working on a new album, right? Yeah, I heard. Well, you won't get to hear it? Motherfucker Gene Carcaney just put millions on the table to keep it all to himself. What does a big pharma CEO want with a rap album? Dude has a huge Bobo collection. And he probably wants to hang that shit on his wall like a damn trophy. Just rubbing his money in our faces, bruh. Do you know if Bobo took the deal? He hasn't announced anything yet, but he will. It's a lot of cash. And maybe there's still time for an intervention. Time for what? I assume you guys have heard of Gene Carcani? He's the shit sack who's on TV laughing about how he's raising the price of leukemia medicine. Yeah, the most hated man in America? Yeah, why do you ask? Guy's a huge Bobo Dakes fan. Must have read Bobo's in town recording new tracks, because he's offering millions to keep the album to himself. So stupid. Bobo will never go for it. The real one won't. So we're gonna do it for him. I'm gonna visit Bobo and see if I can borrow some of his new tracks as proof that we're legit. How do we contact Karkani? I need you guys to run through interviews, podcasts, whatever. Find me some usable lines. We're gonna make a soundboard. Ooh, I love this. Watch it without me. Uh, meet you at the hacker's wave. I'm on my way. got a new Bobo track the world has never heard before. How's the soundboard coming? Yo, a Bobo dates, bitch.
Time to mess with the farmer clown. This ass face deserves it. Hello? Sup? Uh, sup? Who is this? Yo, bitch. It's Bobo Dakes. Holy shit. I'm a huge fan. Are you taking me up on my offer? Yeah, I laid down some hot tracks. Really? Fantastic. Yup. Can I get a sample? That's dope. That's your best work yet. You're welcome. And this is exclusive, right? No one else gets this, just me? Yup. So how do you want payment? The bitch better have my money. I do. I just need to know how to route it to you. Y'all, check it. Ah, there. That's the routing number? Yup. Uh-huh. Sent and confirmed. You got it. This is awesome, man. This is like a dream come true. Yo, bitch, it's Bobo Dakes. What? They say God made man in his own image, but God made himself in Bobo's image. What are you talking about? Yo, bitch, it's Bobo Dakes. No. No. No, 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 no. Shareholders, bitches! <laughs> guys, guys, he just he just donated 20 million to leukemia research. my money <laughs> yo who did that Marcus, our follower count is growing fast. How many are actually giving us access to their computers? All of them. That's the point. They give us access to their power. We grow a network of computers that makes us stronger. Our own giant cloud computing network. So do people sign a contract? I vow to let DedSec own my processor? We're transparent. 
They know before they ever install the app that they're giving us access to their computing power, but never their personal info. That's a lot of trust. Silicon Valley would kill to have that level of intrusion. Private data farming runs their whole economy. Yeah, but we look out for our own, man. That's why people are joining our movement. To make a statement against the technocrats. Yo, Marcus, have you seen the trailer for the new Jimmy Siska movie? No, it's out. Hey, hey, pull it up, no, man. No, 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 not on this. For this, we need perfect sound. We need a big screen. We need to be comfy. You're right. We need quiet. Have you seen it yet? No, nah, man, I waited for you. You're the best. Thank you. All right, everybody, we're going to watch the trailer. Shut the fuck up. Shut up. In a world where technology connects everything. I'm not looking for justice, goddammit. One man prowls the information superhighway in search of cyber justice. I'm looking for cyber justice. Simple line of code could devastate the whole world. It's gonna be a cyber caster. Cyber Driver. Hit him with the code for a chip. Jimmy Siska is... Ah! Oh! Got no choice, kiddies. Follow me, or die. Devin Vaughn Devin. We gotta get these hackers somewhere safe. They aren't hackers, Devin. They're just script kiddies. Hey, the car answered. This ain't your mama's smart car. I think next time we're gonna need a higher firewall, pal. Cyber, Cyber Driver. Action hero, badass. Talking car, admit it, Josh. The car is cool. You know what I'm thinking? We cut our own version of that trailer. And that car is going to help us do it. Real? It would not have us a ton of followers. Yo, first, Josh and I will go to the studio to get that script. We'll look around and see what other gems they have about death sec. And we'll look for the car. All right, so what's the deal here? Are we, are we issuing an advisory? No, why would we do that? They'll just patch the holes. No, uh, let them. Don't worry, Cyber Child. Oh, don't. Hacker movie's gonna get hacked. HMP Studios, we are holding you solely responsible for the draft that is Cyber Driver. Cheesy stunts and bad dialogue, we can take. But you've insulted our intelligence, and that we can't excuse. It seems like you could deal with a lesson on what hackers are capable of. And since you didn't come to us to learn, We'll come to you to teach. We are launching Operation Hack and Run. We'll show you what hackers can do. We are dead set. You guys thought that movie was gonna be good? <laughs> well, yeah, sure. They're fun to laugh at. Cool, you said. Uh, did I actually say cool? Here's what we know, Josh. Cyber Driver is shaped up to be a million dollar cyber catastrophe. I know, you're trying to get my goats with that word. Uh, I don't want that, man. Keep your goats. <laughs> Why would Galilei allow their name to be sullied? You mean cyberized? You can keep trying, but it will never be funny to me. I'm not gonna lie. If those scenes were what they chose for the trailer, yeah, the rest of it's gonna be jack shit. Why they chose to target DedSec is curious. Well, Chicago was a big deal. True. Anyway, don't worry. You and me are prowling the information highway to seek out our own cyber justice. Look, Josh, we're gonna have fun with this. And I promise I won't say cyber anymore. You know, after this, the cyber world will never be the same. 
And there it is, Hook Motion Picture Studios. Okay, guys, I'm in. Here we go. Nice. The not so secret emails.
Total BS. Trail's cold for now. We'll check with the sergeant. I found it. We got the full script of Cyberdriver. What about the car? I don't think it's on site. We'll find it. I'm heading out now. Hey guys, I found an email that says the car is being delivered to a location, but it doesn't say where or when. That's okay. I think I have a backup plan.